All right, so I'm at Walmart and I'm picking up these crazy chicken nuggets, Stranger Things, Kenny Butcher. It says plant powered protein. Um, plant is what my food eats. I like to eat meat, but we're gonna try these anyway, just cause it's Stranger Things and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, here we go. I mean, this is plant-based. Does this mean this is uh, made out of uh, dinosaurs? Since it's on Jurassic Park, Dr. Pepper. All right, I know, fat joke. Hey, you know what? I'll go ahead and do kind of a mini vlog. Um, I like to go to Walmart like two, three times a week. Just kind of get my steps in. But also I like to look for Pokemon cards and toys and see what games we got going on. And you got to check the clearance. You got to check the clearance. Speaking of Stranger Things, you get Stranger Things Light Bright now. A few things, not bad. It's like Walmart is slowly becoming a, uh, a Think Geek slash GameStop <laughs> over here. I tend to not really check these aisles, to be honest. All right, so as far as Pokemon goes, we have a couple pins couple of boxes and then of course the, the toy aisle usually has a lot more I do want to get the quarry I want that game so the toy aisle has always basically been like whatever the newest movie is up front right so Jurassic World then it's usually Transformers then it goes into like the random like cool stuff then we get the Marvel we have the DC then it goes into like the Star Wars. It goes into like the Power Rangers. Then it goes into random. Then it goes into more Pokemon. Oh, we got a decent amount of Pokemon stuff over here too. The Greninja box. All right. These I think are ripoffs, man. They're not worth the price. You get one and then you're just, you're basically buying the promo card and the coin. Fortnite. We get wrestlers and He-Mans and stuff over here. So my toy aisle, I see way people like, like other people have way better Walmarts. Like even other people's clearance sections are better than my Walmart. Like it's hit or miss, but I've seen way better Walmarts with the toys and stuff. All right, so here's a clearance. I've even seen Walmarts that have like better clearance aisles, like in the electronics. Like this Walmart used to have Electronic. Electronic clearance. That's fucking 17 bucks. That ain't clearance. No, I have gotten an air fryer here recently. Uh, not bad. Still 30. Yeah. Nothing really noteworthy here in clearance. We got AEW title there. I like how this turned into like a mini Walmart vlog before I go and put these chicky nuggies <laughs> to the uh, to my air fryer. And I figured I would check the peel box since I'm passing by. So, peel box time, baby. Peel box. Peel box. And looks like I have not one, not two, but three things, because one's a key actually, to pick up. So, let's lock the sucker and let's go get it. All right, so the first one's in 35. So, hey, it's a nice little package. I have no idea who it's from, so. All right, time to get the other two. All right, we got the other two packages. So we got three to unbox. I think these are from like different uh, companies and stuff sending me like stuff, products to review. You know, the shoeing stuff, you really just stupid shoe. So it says plant powered protein. All right. Huh, not too much protein in here. Probably real chicken when I had double that maybe. But five pieces is 320 calories. All right, let's make them. 
I mean, they look like real nuggets, so we'll figure out how they taste in a second. <clears throat> All right. Let's see what we got. All right, so supposedly these are done, so time to taste test in a minute. All right, so they do look nice, crispy. You can never tell that they were plant, right? Imagine being, you know, surprised by that. These are freaking hot. Okay, you can definitely tell it's not chicken, but it has like a peppery, lemony type of flavor to it. Very hot. All right, so I don't have any other sauce except Wendy's Sweet and Sour. Kind of bum, I don't have barbecue. Uh, and I won't use ketchup, I'm an adult. I'm not a kid. I don't like ketchup with my chicken nuggets. I need sauce, I'm an adult. So here we go. It looks like Daisy wants some too. All right, let's see if uh, the plant-based, see if she eats it. Did the plant-based nugget, did it pass the dog test? I don't think she's eating it. No, she's, she's not eating it. She's just kind of chilling with it. So I think she thought it was a legit nugget and she's not impressed. So I got to say the crust outside is fucking fantastic. Like if McDonald's and Wendy's had their nuggets like that breaded, perfect. But when you actually taste the plant-based protein inside... It's hard to describe what I'm tasting. Like obviously they tried to flavor it with something. So it's kind of like a lemon peppery type of taste, but then you don't have that juice, you know, the juicy feel of what an actual piece of chicken would have. So it kind of docks it a little bit. If this was actual chicken, I bet it would taste fucking amazing. So I was tempted. I wanted to see what these chicken nuggets tasted like because it said they were plant-based. I will never ever get them again. Not that they're terrible or anything, but it's just not for me. So the marketing campaign with Stranger Things got me though. Crust is fucking delicious. So yeah, nah, I want real meat. 